For this contact form, we can change the background color. We can change the hover color inside the box. And then uh, we can change the input fields. For example, uh, there's a button as well, which you can edit. This is fairly complex for us to get the styling this way. For that reason, we'll spend some time in the custom CSS where we can change the color. Uh, we can change the field input color and then the button color can be updated as well. You can see there's quite a few settings here. I won't spend much time optimizing those. You can spend time fixing them up the way that you want them to be. So it will be trial and error to get it exactly right. For now, let's have a look and see how we can change the background color. We want to go into the section module settings. I'm just going to pick a, a darkish gray over here uh, and let's do a quick preview. Okay, that's good for me. For an example, let's continue onwards. So we've got uh, the text. You can change that if you want. We can change the headline text color. I think we'll leave this as is for the moment. Let's switch to advanced. Nothing incredible there. Uh, so let's close this out. Next, we want to look at the form itself. So these are labeled out. Let's click on one of these. Let's go to the settings. And you can experiment with these to get them exactly right. Uh, I'm just going to change a few of them. So we've got the input field. And then you can choose the different types here and go through them. For this, to understand how all of these uh, contact form input fields work, I recommend you refer to the Divi uh, training uh, uh, documents for that. That would be best. From our side, we just want to change the styles for this in particular. Uh, again, we will need to go to the custom CSS. Uh, which is over here. So first of all, uh, let's change the text color. Um, let's grab that. We can do a bright green color for this over here. Let's paste that in there. And then the input field color will make that a light green, um, mint green in this case. Let's just switch over there, let's paste it in here. And then the button color will, will let's, let's just change one of them uh, as an example. That will be the background and then you will need to experiment to get them exactly right the way that you want. Uh, we also have a page container. Let's see, there's another background color. That's the purple. Uh, let's go with a darker color on that one. We'll make it dark green. I have no idea what this is going to look like, but hopefully it will show to you how these can be updated. So we've updated all of those for the paragraph contact form. Let's copy that. And then what we want to do is paste it into the custom CSS box. There we go. And let's just click save on that and then update. And now we can reload the page. There we go. So you can see the input field has changed. The text color is white in this case. Um, with regards to changing these particular fields and options in them, please refer to the Divi documentation. You can see the buttons change to a different color and you can experiment and get those exactly right. That's how you update this contact form. Thanks for watching.